in this video we study about an another important type of relation which is named as symmetric relation we have already covered trivial relations identity relations reflexive relation and now in the line is symmetric relation let us study what is a symmetric relation and then let's see an example for the same i have written this definition for reading purpose and let's see and understand this definition by what all mathematical terms are written here and what all important vocab is written here a relation r on the set a is said to be a symmetric relation if and only if i double f is actually read as if and only if ab belongs to r ba belongs to r for every a comma b belongs to a that means if i have a set which is capital a if this is the set capital a then if different elements of the set are related such that the first and the second element are present and the second and the first element in the ordered pair is also present then it is a symmetric relation let's see an example first understand it and then we get back to the definition for the mathematical part let's see an example for the same suppose i have a relation for a set a now a is a set given to me such that a has 1 2 two elements only and the relation on the set is defined by r such that r is what r is 1 comma 2 and it has 2 comma 1 as well you see there are two ordered pairs in this set 1 2 and 2 1 now let's see whether this relation r is symmetric or not r is symmetric when r is symmetric when a related to b and also b should be related to a that means if a comma b is present then b comma a should also be present for a relation to be a symmetric relation 1 2 2 1 comma 2 is present yes it is 2 comma 1 is present yes it is so this relation is simply an example of symmetric relation now let's see some other example okay if you have been given a set this example works when you have already been given a set and you can define symmetric relation out of the same let's see another example to this we all know what does similarity of triangle mean similar triangles are the ones with certain conditions same that is suppose two triangles are given they might not be same in shape or size congruency and similarity don't get confused similarity definitely means one thing that the size may or may not be same but the shape is same so for that i say an example similarity of triangles similarity of triangles similarity of triangles is one such example where symmetric relation would work how and why let's see suppose i have been given two triangles t1 and t2 and the relationship is what relationship on these triangles is nothing but r triangles are similar triangles are similar is the relationship that is given to us now for this relationship what do we know we know that if any two triangles t1 and t2 are taken can we say that for symmetric purpose t1 is related to t2 yes because t1 is similar to t2 now can we say also that t2 is related to t1 yes because t2 is related to t1 t2 is similar to t1 since we have both the things present here that t1 comma t2 is belonging to r also t2 comma t1 also belongs to r both the things are present a related to b and b related to a so this is a perfect example again of symmetric relation 
So in this video, what did we see? In this video, we saw what is a symmetric relation with some examples to the same. In the subsequent videos, we'll be seeing the basic definition and understanding of transitive relation with an example and equivalence relation also with an example to the same. I hope you understood symmetric relation thoroughly.